The Swiss Armed Forces must be able to receive and send information securely and reliably at all times. Only then can it fulfill its task. To be able to ensure security in cyberspace, the armed forces need secure and independent infrastructures, networks, and means of communication. These three elements are closely interconnected. The national nodes process and store information. They are the brain of the new digitalization platform, NDP. They are robust, autonomous, and function redundantly. If one national node fails, the next one automatically takes over. In 2020, the two national nodes, Data Center 1 and 2, went into operation. Data Center 2 is protected against forces of nature in accordance with civilian standards and is also used by civilian federal agencies. Data Center 1 is fully protected, which means secured against both forces of nature and weaponry and is used exclusively by the armed forces. The same applies to the third data center, Castro 2, which is to be built and equipped in the next few years. The Swiss command and control network is like a nervous system. It transports information to and from the brain, the three national nodes. The network consists of fiber optic cables, directional beam connections, and communication nodes, all of which are protected and function autonomously. This crisis-resistant data and communication network is continually upgraded and expanded where necessary. In extraordinary situations, the civilian partners, such as the fire service and police, can communicate independently of civilian providers via this network. The third element is the Armed Forces Telecommunication System. It is secured and mostly wireless. Military personnel are able to access the information they need from the national nodes at all times and from anywhere in the country. They also act like sensory organs and feed information into the system. Thanks to Cyber Command, the public can depend on the armed forces and the Swiss security network at all times. Furthermore, Cyber Command also supports our cyber defenses. As information technology is developing and evolving at breakneck speed, the armed forces must also continually renew and expand their information and communications technologies. This is being implemented in several stages. Functionalities are being expanded and the security of the infrastructure improved with each stage. Cyber Command enables the armed forces and its partners from the Swiss security network to be deployed wherever they are needed, regardless of the situation. Interconnected, robust, and autonomous. For a secure Switzerland.